Ishin's not happy that you just killed his doctor, and rightfully so. Also, you're also betraying uh, uh, the whole of Ashina right here, and he doesn't appreciate that too much. Right, I, I got into the habit of using the Ichimanji double here for Emma's fight, but I don't recommend doing that, because uh, you, you, you're gonna have to be quick about this. No, no real big sweeps or strikes or anything are gonna get you through this fight. Also, phase one is a lot easier than phase two. As you can see, his, his Ichimanjis are very easily uh, parryable. Keep in mind though, if you mess up the Ichimanji, then he's gonna fuck you up. That shit hurts a lot. When he, when he stands all casually like, like this, don't hit him more than once. Or actually like, oh shit, that was way quicker than I thought it was gonna do that. Jesus. I thought he was gonna wait for his, his bigger thing to pop up, like the Ashina Elite stuff. I uh, I forgot what, what I was about to say. Again, did not realize what he was about to do here. Keep talking about how much easier phase one is than phase two, and then I proceed to just mess everything up in phase one. Oh yeah, and when he does combos, they have different timings, so it can be very difficult to actually learn to see uh, when he's about to swing at you. Well, don't worry, we'll get this, uh, we'll get that back when we stab him for the second phase. No real threat here. We're still good. Make sure you parry that at the right moment. You have to wait for him to slam down. It can take a while, so just be patient. Now phase two will start, and a lot of shit is going to happen right now. Specifically this, move to a spot where there is no fire, block the first attack, then the big flurry, and then try to time the last one. You're gonna want to put the pressure on him, by the way, because uh, you want this phase to end quickly, or actually like the whole fight to end quickly, really. I spoke as if there are several phases after this, which there are not. But yeah, you want this to end as quickly as humanly possible. Because you, you might... You might want to... Tank your way through this fight, really. Because he's he does a lot of wacky shit, this dude. Specifically this shit. I recommend jumping to the side. Uh, run away from him when he's about to charge it up. And then jump to the side. Just to be on, stay on the safe side. Now he's gonna use this big thing to move to a spot where there is no fire, block the first one, then the flurry, and try to time the last one, because then he's gonna get stunned very shortly, which gives you time to smack him once. Try to Makira counter that, I messed up now though. Did not manage to get away from this in time, but luckily we got one of our resurrections back from stabbing him once. So we still, we're still in this, no worries here, no worries whatsoever. That's the big charge. Block that. Flurry. Time that. Kite oh, almost perfectly. Oh shit, this shit again. That is very stressful. I hate trying to dodge that. It's so hard trying to find the, the proper moment to do that. I, I'm gonna have to say like, this is one of the few fights that I still regularly struggle with. Shit. Because it does so much wacky shit. And I haven't really done this route a whole lot. You're welcome for this brilliant strategy guide, by the way. Oh, Mikiri. Take advantage of that. And then smack him once. Actually, I got to smack him three times. That's a hell of a lot at this point. You have a lot of time to heal when he casts this ability. Wow. He hit us uh, a bit too much right now. Come to the side and try to run off to him and smack him once. Akira counter that and give him a smack. Oh, kiss. You might be tempted to go in for. Oh, shit. Akira, when he walks off to the side like that, then he's basically just telegraphing, I'm about to Mikiri you. Be careful. That's the last of our healing. I was way too late. I was very greedy with my parry button right now. Oh shit, I almost timed that very wrong. Holy shit! Oh my god! 
Well, as scuffed as this might be, I hope this was a proper-ish guide for how to defeat this dude. Sekiro. But it, the, the, this was definitely not one of my most beautiful attempts at this, but hopefully I gave you some instructions for how to beat this guy. It scuffed as though it might have been.